Adventure World has apologised to patrons who were turned away yesterday after the park reached capacity for the first time in its 33-year history. The unprecedented move prompted crowds to line up early this morning to avoid disappointment. An early start for thrill seekers this morning, queuing for entry to Adventure World more than an hour before it opened, eager to get through the gates after punters were turned away when the park reached capacity yesterday. Uh, yeah, we heard that. That's why we came really early, so yeah, to try and get in, yeah, and get a good spot. Mm -hmm. CEO Mark Shaw says Adventure World doesn't have a set capacity but is licensed to hold up to 8,000 patrons. But for yesterday's scorcher, management decided to cap entry at 5,500 people. It sounds busy but you know the park can accommodate more but we choose to uh, limit it so that people that are here and paying their hard-earned money can have a good time. More than a dozen people were turned away from Adventure World yesterday. They were given discounted tickets to return again. Adventure World says the best way to guarantee entry is to book ahead online. The park didn't reach capacity today, but it was still busy, with the newest feature, a $7 million water slide, pulling the longest queue. That would be at about 64 minutes average at the moment. But like I say, the most of the other rides would be about 15, 20 minutes uh, on a big day like today. Rachel Carey, Nine News.